Lifted out piece by piece, two new tunnel boring machines arrive at the bays near Roselle. Rolled into place on a remote controlled 96 wheeler, then lowered 34 metres below ground, ready for assembly. TBM assembly takes about 10 weeks and from start to finish. The 1100 tonne machines will launch later this year, making six TBMs all working to connect Parramatta and the CBD. These will help us complete the 24 kilometre twin tunnels to deliver Metro West. TBMs Beatrice and Daphne are currently at Five Dock, while Betty and Dorothy are at Newington, all four heading west. These yet-to-be-named machines will head east under the harbour to Piemont, then onto Hunter Street. Red Dog has been driving TBMs for 18 years. Heading below the harbour is a new challenge. We can pressurise the front of the cutter head to um, match the water pressure. These tunnel boring machines are fitted with a specialised cutting head to excavate the sandstone that lies deep under Sydney Harbour. But despite their sheer size, it's slow going, travelling at just 15 metres every day. Cars measured in uh, kilometres an hour and uh, these machines uh, are measured in millimetres per minute. Slow and steady for one very big project. Taylor Aiken, 7 News.